Hello everyone! As I promised in my last video, I will show you how to get 4 star weapons early in chapter 3. You can do this method in chapter 2, but the only stages you can do this are the last 2 stages in chapter 2. Now, I'm cho I choose this stage, or chose this stage, mainly because it's easier to get 4 star weapons with this method. You need to have bio sending at maximum proficiency S and Xiaofao at proficiency S. It is very highly recommended that you do max them out at level 99 and max their weapons out. And also have prosperity and slay absorption osmosis at 10. Now this is extremely optional because this is, this is going to require you to play on chaos mode um, to get these 4 star weapons. And this is really dangerously hard if you are not prepared for this. So that's one weapon box. But um, if you want to look at their abilities that I have on their weapons, just uh, go back in the beginning of this video and you know pause the video so you can see what I have. You don't have to have everything matched up, but it's very important to have slay, prosperity, uh, absorption, osmosis, maxed at 10. Your weapon also needs to be maxed out. I highly recommend using a one star weapon as they provide more attack strength power. Now the reason why I have um, Bio Shinings and Jaqua in my party is because their abilities are the exact same thing. So they really serve as my Plata's belt, which I do not have at the moment, um, which does the same thing as their abilities, but I think their abilities are a little bit more better. So having both of them in your party does increase the chances of you getting better weapons. You don't need to have them at level 99. You can, all you need is at least one of them at level 99. But I have them at but I have both of them at level 99, so it's more efficient for me. If you don't have absorption, you're, you're gonna die extremely easy doing this because you gotta have your HP, you gotta regain your HP back in chaos mode. There's no, um, there's no food or any HP supportive uh, drops in this mode, so you're gonna have to have absorption to gain your HP back. Oh my gosh, I'm getting raped right now. Get your ass out of there. I have the reason I have Himiko in the party, she doesn't really serve anything. Um I have her in the party just so I would be able to get her better weapons. That's the reason why she's in the party. So my third person is basically the person I'm targeting to get better weapons with. I hate those arrows, oh my gosh, because they just ruin your combo. Another weapon box. I'm getting a lot of weapon box drops. And like I said, you need that Prosperity 10 to get those drops. Now, it's not going to automatically drop a weapon box. This happens randomly. But it increases the chances of getting weapon drops. And I, this is a extremely optional to do. You don't need to do this. I wouldn't recommend doing this if you are just starting to play this game. But for experienced players like me, might want to consider doing this just so you have better weapons already. Oh shit. Gotta watch out for Ninja. 
Oh, damn it. Get out of the way. Oh. Damn, I'm almost died. Almost died there, guys. Do not want to play around with this guy. You need to take him out quick. Where'd he go? Also, make sure you keep him off the ground so he won't do his Maju attack. Goodbye. Aw, oh, that wasn't a weapon drop. Oh well. Wow, she's barely alive after that attack. If you think he was bad, imagine Sasana. <laughs> He's just gonna be a blocking whore, so I'm just gonna use that. Crap, another freaking EXP drop. Not what I wanted. So you don't get the weapon drops all the time. If you're gonna if you're going to attempt to do this, make sure you do it on chaos mode first. I mean not chaos mode, um hard mode first, and then you do chaos mode if you feel like your characters are ready. But really you shouldn't do this until your characters are like at level 99 with um a maxed out weapon. <laughs> So this is kind of time consuming when you're leveling up characters, but the fastest way to level characters is by using Daji's ability and making sure your weapon has wisdom at 10 and diligence at 10. That is the combo of leveling up your characters extremely fast. When you combine those two abilities at 10 with Daji's ability. But her 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 proficiency ability needs to be at letter S. And here comes Sasano. He is gonna be a tough cookie to beat. Here we go. Come on, just die, please. Please just die. There we go. Okay, time to chase after Sasano. Hopefully, I don't die. I shouldn't be able to die. I got a true Mizu. I got a triple little Mizu attack, so I should be all right. I should be all right. If I don't kill him, the triple Mizu will. Damn it! Bad choice. Should have never blocked that attack. Oh shit! Better use it now. I pissed him off. Oh, he's dead. Yeah, he's definitely gone. Oh yeah, two weapon box. Sweet. As soon as, soon as his music stops playing, or his theme stops playing, you know you killed him. 
but he was already like destroyed before I even finished doing the mission with that. Well, the rest is pretty much easy selling for me. I just gotta defeat Sima Yi and Sima Shi. So far, I have about, I would say, three characters. Yeah, I have three characters at level 99. Sima Zhou and Bao Sanings and Jia Kua are my three level 99 characters. Honestly, I only need one of them, but having them at level 99 would be more helpful. That way they can give me better weapons and I can use them in battle. Good night. Damn you, Sima Yi. Oh, you are not going to do I don't think so. He's instantly dead. Damn! He got raped bad. By females. He's lucky. Ooh, a weapon box. Oh, it's not semi she it's Kao P. I don't know why. I keep getting these two mixed up for some reason. Crap. Yes, I'm going to miss because no one's there. Oh well. Ready to go. I'm like, where'd he go? And then BAM! <laughs> that wasn't too bad. Of course it wasn't. Of course it wasn't that bad. Nice weapons. She didn't get any level four or four star weapons, but as you can see, I already have four star weapons. Doom Spinner. So I've been doing this weapon farming for a while. So I'm just going to discard all these stuff here because I don't really need them. See, Jacqueline has her 4 star weapon. Got some good abilities with them too. No thanks. I don't want that crappy weapon. Dragon fan. I already have those, so I'm just gonna discard them. I don't really need any more weapons for them. Oh, Himiko has her four-star weapons. Nice. 
Her first two weapons she ever gotten are her are four star weapons. Slave three. This method won't get you the rare abilities. You have to play like in a very, very hard stage to get those. But this will get you the four star weapons early in chapter three. Matratsu. There's a lot of Naruto reference in this game. But anyway. Thanks for watching guys, I hope this helped.